Hello and welcome back to another episode of Final Fantasy VII Remake with Mimioni. Last time we pretty much dealt with the underbelly of the uh, Sector 4 plate there. We're in the actual reactor now, I believe, and things are about to hot up. Excuse the pun. So let's go on without further ado. So here we are with this beautiful... Well, I'm not really sure what's going on here. There's some kind of like laser strip lighting and then there's uh, what appears to be a robot down there and one of them is missing. Maybe that's foreshadowing for something in the future. I wonder what it could be. If you've played the original Final Fantasy VII, then you'll have an inkling what that actually is. That uh, particular device there. It looks very familiar to me. So this place is sort of like... I don't know, the outer area of a reactor, the perimeter passageway. So let's get cracking. I'm going to try and not be as distracted as I usually am. A few people have been a little bit salty in the comment section about me uh, basically going off the beaten track, but... I'm not seeing a way down. You know, I do me. What are we talking? That could work. Aha! I'm next. Ooh, bye Tifa. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go. Wee! Oh, I didn't know I was actually. No, I wasn't controlling it. Kind of scary, huh? It's all in the mind. I see you, loot. I see you. I'm coming for you. You can't escape me. You can't escape my eyes. Give me that loot. I need that loot. Three high potions. Okay, I don't need that loot, but it's nice to have you nonetheless. We've got 27 of you and then 99 of normal. There we go. Look at these robot places. Hmm. Hey, check it out. They stick this big boy on us, we'd be screwed six ways from Sunday. Mechanized units like these were designed to take out giant monsters. Probably a new prototype. If they do decide to deploy it, then our best bet would be to run like hell. Oof. Then let's hope he sleeps through the explosion. Yeah, you know that's not going to happen. That thing looks menacing. I love it. I love it. They can't help notice there are two missing, though. Just saying. I think that should be our major concern. Unless it is just a prototype. But More crates to smash. No more Moogle coins. Sad face. How many Moogle coins do we have now? That is a good question. So under key items, we have 11. Okay, I'm sure I've missed some then on the way, but let's try not to dwell about it too much. Ooh. Where is everybody? You mean Shinra? <laughs> Got spooked and cleared out is my guess. Well, it's a good guess, but you know. Oh no, there we go. Speak of the devil and you shall receive. Okay. Is that all of them? Oh no, we got some up in it's the air you. there. Boom. Good night. There we go. Nothing to it. There we go. Another reactor. Just like the last one. Kinda. Slightly better lit, I think. This is way better looking, but no oh well. Let's see if there's any Moogle coins then. No, an antidote. That's pretty cool. Down we go. So we've got automated stuff attacking us. No sign of any troops yet. It takes me back. Yeah, it would do for reasons. Echo mist, I think that's the stuff that gets rid of um Well let's not speculate because somebody will correct me, right? So echo mist. That cure silence. You see, I thought it did, but I didn't want to make the assumption. I'll have learned from the comment section so far. <laughs> There's a Moogle medal. Lovely jubbly. Add those to our collection. More robots to take care of. We're on the ground at the minute. So let's make the most of that. I'll do. Don't draw that, that though. Oh, these things are quick, pretty quick, aren't they? But are they quicker than my thunder? I still need to level this up, so we need to use more of these. So that's why I'm using the lower level one and not Thundaga, because, well, 
He needs to level it up. I need everyone to have, like, at least level 2 magic, really. In theory. But we're not going to push it too hard if we don't. Okay, down we go. Towards this section with sweeper robots, I think those are, down there. Okay, let's make sure we have enough. Yeah, we have plenty of MP. We should have no problem with these two units right here. Yeah, I knew they would come to life. So somebody said in the comment section before, this tactical mode and you can switch between people without switching between them, which is great. Um, but I find that their ATB feels faster if I actually switch to that character. So that's why I've been doing it in the previous things. Someone else said, why is he dodging in Punisher mode? Um, I think that's because it's a viable option as well. I know it's slow, but I like to maintain Punisher mode as much as I can. You see, usually I would be concentrating here, but I'm talking to you guys. But let's cast some thunder on this. Switch to Tifa because she needs to fill her bar here. Barret's right, getting absolutely obliterated, but what we can do now is we can use Vandara on one of the sweepers. Like that. Oh, it takes no damage off, does it? That's crazy. We're going to get summon. Please tell me that's a new summon, because I'm not that fond of seeing Cactuar every five seconds. We'll see, shall we? Um, I also have to get used to actually, you know, using Chakra and stuff more often, so I can get Omni Strike, because Omni Strike does a ton of damage. Here we go, Chocobo Chick. So this is actually from the other DLC. I believe. I've not seen this one yet, so let's check it out. Oh, I still don't like his hair, but... Come on then, dude. What, what do you do? Let's see. He does Choco Fire, Choco Blizzard, Thunder. Ooh, or Choco Gust. That sounds like a plan. Let's do some Thunder damage. Uh, okay, let's actually make sure that Cloud heals here. Wow, we have Kuraga. Damn. That's a bit heavy-handed, but... That's going to be a full heal right there. And we might as well do that to Barrett as well, who's pretty low. Meanwhile, we need to get Tifa some ATB. Oh, she's bound. How messy is this fight? I'm making it look bad. I would apologize, but I'm having too much fun. Sorry. If you wanted pro play, you came to the wrong place. Uh, okay, dodge roll out of that. Come on, Choco. Choco Thunder would be nice right about now. Lovely. Is he going to do his ultimate attack? Yes, he is. Choco Flare. Oh, wow. Wow, that did a lot of damage. Holy crap. I'm not sure I even did much damage to the other one. I probably did passively, or the other the other guys did, but... Damn, that's pretty good. So we took a fair bit of a beating there, but what we should be doing is using some of these damn potions, right? I have seen people complain that I'm not using them, so... Let's get to that. They do a fair amount, and we have plenty of them, and no way to use them. I suppose what we could do is sell them, and then we could make some gill. I think we can do that at one of those potion seller things. Let's see, let's heal Cloud up. Here we go. We've got all the crates. All right, onwards. Onwards we go. Onwards and downwards. And yeah, this Marco looks uh, a lot bluer than the green I was used to. Suppose it comes in different colors, or so it was like this last time. A little more chaotic, ain't that right? Yeah. Yeah, it was pretty similar, but this looks way more modern for some reason to me. I don't know why. Come on then, give me your precious loops. Bulletproof Vest. I believe we already have seen those before, but just to double check, because obviously we don't want to... Yeah, so that's another one of those. That's Vitality 5%. I don't think we necessarily need that. Um, just to show you as well, with the Materia, we've got the Chocobo Chick. We've got Ifrit, uh, Chocobo and Moogle, which we haven't tried out yet. And uh, we also have Carbuncle as well, which we haven't tried out. So let's switch Tifa to Carbuncle and see if um, if we can get that one to prog. 
and then we'll do the same because for some reason tifa seems to proc all of the summons and i'm not sure why that is um i don't know what the logic is behind whoever it chooses but if that is the case we'll just keep switching the materia on tifa to the one we want to see um we still haven't checked out if we properly yet so there's that yeah this stuff is definitely more blue than green but I suppose it doesn't really have a colour, or... Don't know. Sephiroth. Soldiers. Maka. Shinra. I'm sick of this. I'm sick of all of this! <laughs> Don't cry, Tifa. That's her father, I believe. <sighs> oh, that Mazamune. Hey, soldier boy. Tifa. What? Oof. All right, and bring it on. Let's blow this place to kingdom come. Or try. How much time we need? Got all the time in the world. This one comes with a remote detonator. Courtesy of Jesse. Good idea. <laughs> we withdraw to a safe distance. Then, kaboom! Safe distance? What? No such thing? <laughs> well, we get out the same way we got in. Let's double back. Sounds like a plan. Nothing can possibly get in our way, can it? Not at all. Not even in the slightest. Huh? What, what the? Where are you going? Weirdly perfect timing. Wait a minute. Is someone watching us? <sighs> Greetings, my dear sewer rats. As architect of our populous engagement campaign, I, Heidegger, head of public security, bid you welcome. The chief warmonger. You should be flattered. Right now, you command the undivided attention of every soul in Midgar. Huh? What is this? Breaking news from Mako Reactor 5. Shinra has confirmed the reactor to be the target of the bomb threat issued by the terrorist group Avalanche. <clears throat> Members of the group were observed entering the facility, and security is currently sweeping it for explosive devices. We now go live to the scene. I'm here in the Sector 5 Undercity. Having confirmed the terrorist target, the Shinra Emergency Operation Center has issued an evacuation advisory. Residents are outraged that the tragedy of Mako Reactor 1 was only the first attack in a campaign of violence. President Shinra has issued a statement providing assurances that the terrorists will soon be brought to justice. And so... To a people beset by chaos and uncertainty, we will offer the finest comfort, bread and circus. The big boy, I give you Sigma's latest triumph of technology. The Air Buster, your executioner. Oh, God. Engineering on the line. Career the Airbuster is only 60% operational. The estimates were optimistic. I'm on air! <laughs> to the imbecile in charge down there. You are here by order to seize those intruders and bring them to me. Oh. I'm quietly announcing trouble! Okay, shock troopers, time to get busy with you. Get some damage in before they pound me silly. Just 
guy is going after Tifa, so you have to go down first, my friend. Definitely. Okay, this is not working. Let's triple slash them. Two, three, okay. We've got another ATB. Let's go for another triple slash. So one of them's elite, and then two of them are non-elite, right? I think that's what this is. Come on then. Let's get Barrett's overcharge off. And we also need to do Thunder on you to learn more spells for that. And Tifa, what can we summon? We can summon Carbuncle. Why don't we, indeed? Adorable, but weird face. That massive forehead, though. Oh, God. I thought it was just a meme, but no. Jeez. There we go. That's what I was trying to do. Okay, what can we do, Carboncore? We can do Ruby Light, which halves the physical damage taken by party members, halves magic damage, and increases the rate at which the ATB gauge fills, but we need two ATBs for that. That sounds fine. Let's fill that up. Come on in, Carby. Give us Emerald Light, please. That would be lovely. There we go. Now we should fill a lot faster, right? Or everything dies. I don't believe it. We played right into Shinra's hands. Yeah, and their bullshit right news is already peddling their false narrative. <sighs> so we're screwed. Attention, all security. No, 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 no. Hell no. Listen, they want to turn this into a spectacle. Then I say, let's give them one. Let's take down Shinra's big ass neck in front of everybody. Okay. Right now. I'm sold. Sounds like a plan. And then we blow it up, right? Attention, all security forces. Okay, time to use some potions. That was very messy. Very messy indeed. But we'll try to be better on the boss. Well, really, it takes a lot of potions, doesn't it? I need to find a way of converting potions into, uh the high potions if that's even a thing you can do screw it i can't be bothered to be full go on give me the boss we're in the assembly plant now another potion lovely all right let's go What is that? Intruder! Take him out! Okay, elite, elite security officer. You might be the one I go for, to be honest with you. And um, whilst we're here as well, let's do an assess. Simply because I don't think we've assessed these guys. And we managed to scan them all there. So their weakness is fire. Okay, cool. That's cool. I believe Barrett has fire magic. No, it's actually Cloud that has the fire magic. Oh, well. Come on, Tifa. Let's get your bar filled as well. And let's do some damage with Cloud. I think Cloud actually has Fire. He has Fire Arga. Well, that guy's about to get blitzed then, isn't he? Good night. Oh, 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 oh. oh, that was sweet. Sweet justice. It used pretty much all of our mana, though. But it was worth it, right? My goodness, we hit hard. Let's see what these bastards were up to. Eh. Over here. But what does that do? I want to click that. Is there any loots? Actually, I want to click that. I want to. I want to click this. I don't care. I'm clicking it. You really need to see this. Oh. Okay. Never mind then. It looks like a few of its components are still in transit. <laughs> We'll see about that. Could tamper a little with its loadout. 
and give ourselves an edge? There should be a console somewhere. This the console you talk So what about? we got? Programming cores, bomber shells, and M units. Interesting. Think you can get it to work? Needs a key card. Well, let's find it then. Okay. We need key cards. How big is this place? Hmm. Can we get through here? Let's not leave before we're done, huh? All right, so it's definitely in here somewhere, huh? Okay. Are you a key card? You're a key card. You find it? Yeah. Good job. Now let's check out that console. Yeah, if we can disable some of its weapons, it'll make it look very simple. I wish we could open those component boxes, but Come on, Cloud. Click the button. I'm guessing that's some sort of component? Yep. An enhancement powered by liquefied materia. Sounds bad. Pretty sure I can divert this unit for disposal. Disposing of M units. Remo removing M units from the Airbuster will reduce the number of items it has at its disposal. While this does not directly affect the Airbuster's tactical performance, collecting the discarded items can give your party a much needed boost in the Bites. Uh, sure. Go for it. I'm sure there's an achievement where we don't dispose any, though. There must be, right? M unit flagged for disposal. Serves you all right. So far, so good. Right. Let's move. I agree. Unless there's more key cards or something. That could be quite entertaining. You think they're watching us? Even now? Yep. Probably got a live feed. Nothing we can do about it. Except smile for the folks at home. Sounds like a plan. Let's give them a decent show, eh? In fact, to give them the best show possible, I think we should probably get rid. Um Oh, that's this. Yeah, I, I want, I want the Ifrit materia. On no, I want it on 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 Tifa. For some reason, she gets all of the good stuff. There we go. And we'll just burn it to death. That sounds like a plan. Ooh, more robots. Okay. Let's get rid of that one. Okay, we can also use, uh, ooh, I didn't know we had that. Interesting. Let's just thunder these then. Get some lovely, lovely levels on that. Might as well. Our T3 is doing some serious damage to them. Alrighty then. What's this then? Some kind of cable that was never finished? That's a bit weird. Onwards we go then. How are we doing for mana? We have no mana. Okay, let's get an ether on cloud at least. Uh, make that two ethers for cloud. <laughs> okay, and then we'll do a quick... Mm, do a quick cure. There we go. And the rest can have a heal during the fight. Sounds sort of like a good plan to me. Component outbound from B7. Copy. We've lost contact with B8. Send some men to check it out. We've got a schedule to keep. Huh. Intruders! Seize them! Okay, so I am thinking that if I hadn't have even bothered taking any of the components away, it would have made for a harder fight. But it's too late now, right? I've already taken one away. So, I'm sure there will be an achievement listed to that. Looks like there's two consoles this time. Double the sabotage. If we can find the key cards. 
We should be able to. They were just on a bench last time. I think I saw it on a cutscene, actually, leaning against something. Uh, there's one, right? What is Materia? Any cards? Just the one. Two choices. And only one single-use card. It's up to you, Cloud. That sounds fine to me. Let's get rid of these crates. There's the Moogle medal. Yes. And what are you? Lightning materia. Well, you know, you never know, do you? So, what did it? What does this side do? Console talks about big bomber shells. You acquainted? We call them BBs. One's enough to blow you to hell and back. Could divert them and give it a couple less shots to take us out. Make the call. Hmm. Removing the big bombers from the airbuster will reduce the number of big bomber shells it has at its disposal. Uh, they hit your party hard. The fewer shells fired your way to save your party will be. Well, yeah, let's get rid of those then. Might as well. I'm not sure what the other thing is, but... Do we need to know at this point? Big bomber shell flag for disposal. Just imagine in their faces when they find out. So where did we send the discarded stuff? To a storeroom for defective equipment, I'm guessing. That's so. You think these defective shells and programming cores might be valuable enough to warrant a little detour? Maybe. I say we grab them. <laughs> if we get that far. Okay. I would love to. That sounds like a lot of fun, getting these bomb things. I'm not sure what we would use. Well, I suppose we could use them for, like, future bombing missions, right? Okay. Listen up, y'all. Everything Shinra has told you is a goddamn lie. Marco is the lifeblood of our planet. Those greedy bastards are bleeding it dry. Y'all gotta rise up. Barrett, who are you talking to? The people. Put me on TV. I'm gonna drop some truth. Thousand Gill says they cut the sound. <laughs> it's a good effort, though. I mean, I'd do the same. So this optional stuff. Where would you be? Where would you be? I didn't see any doors that way, but... I really want to find them, if possible. Surprise, Rounders! Hi there. It's not really a surprise if I knew it was going to happen. Okay, braver for you, my friend. And you dodged it. Brilliant. That's really cool AI, actually. Okay. Get out of the sky. Get down from there. Come on. Stop being an asshole. It's time to say goodnight, friend. Wow, that didn't really do that much damage to the Jeez. That's surprising. Omni Strike will lurk. Oh, we missed a cannon thingy? I can reach it. It's fine. Oh, there's another one. Damn. Let's overcharge you. Boom. Oh, wow. They killed it before I had the chance. But Barrett, you didn't get the killing blow, my friend. It doesn't work that way. Unless you get a killing blow, you're not allowed to sing that song. New rule, okay? I made that rule. I'm the one with a big sword, after all. Did we really just come back down? Eh. This is what disorientation looks like, if you didn't know. So we're looking for like a little passageway or an extra door or something anything really more dudes there's a dude no get off let me dodge roll past you you annoying person <laughs> sounds like a triple slash to me Are you really trying to program that whilst I'm fighting? Because that's kind of annoying, sir. 
and very easily destroyed. There we go. Oh no, grenade! No, 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 no! Yeah, you keep shooting at those like weird rocket shells or containment vessels. That's fine. Just don't shoot me, yeah? Boom. Good night. Okay, what's in this room? Another key card. We got discarding one of them, right? It says two of three. There's another control panel. There's another control panel. Are we seeing any key cards here? There's a key card. Let me pick it up, please. I'm pressing triangle. There we go. Find any cards? Only one. And this time we've got three choices. Take your pick. Uh, so we've got a choice between M units, programming cores. I mean, hmm. what does this one do? Hell is this? M unit, another type of enhancement. You'll call if you want to nix it. What does it do? Reduce the number of items it has at its disposal. No, I'll leave that one. I'm not really sure what that's. Can you get out of the way, Barrett, please? Bomber shells seem to be pretty Feel good. Like scrapping some BBs? Hurry up and decide what you want to get rid of. It's past time we taught Shinra a lesson. Let's just get rid of the bombs. That would be pretty useful, right? Big bomber shell flag for disposal. There it goes to wherever we need I to find. Got no idea who he's messing with. Well, clearly someone who doesn't like big bomber shells. Where is that going then? So it's going that way. Am I supposed to follow the... The shell? I am so confused where the extra area will be. To be honest with you. I'm sure we'll find an access way at some point, maybe. I tell you what. I ain't never look forward to an execution more in my entire life. <laughs> <laughs> you don't say. We're about to make fools out of Shinra while the whole damn city's watching. <laughs> Times like these, you gotta save her. Oh no, if you're about to ask me to dance, then don't. Come on, don't be shy. How about you, Cloud? I don't dance. Why would Tifa dance? Have you been getting Tifa to dance for you? Unbelievable. I wish I could get Tifa to dance. I want to see Tifa dance, damn it. That'd be adorable. No dudes. There's a chest with... Purple chest? Pinky, pinky purple? A pair of Sonic Strikers. Those look to be something tifa -y. Did we learn that spell yet no we haven't learned that one so these ones have four materia slots holy moly but do quite a bit less damage what do they do focus strike evade then unleash a charging attack moderately increases their stagger that looks awesome but we need to max this out first even if there is four materia slots um we will pass for now but i will switch to that later that's awesome What's in here? No, just a potion. Okay. Literally, you can't spend potions faster than they're actually giving you them. Which I suppose is a good thing for, like, you know, a hard mode playthrough. But my goodness, they're giving you a lot here early on. Okay. Time to take you down, my friend. Oh, wow. That guy got absolutely cream crackered. What the heck? Yeah, the abilities do so much damage. I love it. Boom, boom. Boom. Yeah, bravery is like the best thing ever, isn't it? Let's be honest. Bunch of pushovers. Come on, y'all. Let's see what kind of mischief they were getting up to. There's another key card. Four consoles. 
and never enough key cards. So we've got M units over here. We've got big bomber shells. Yeah, that's the one I was going to go for. Right, I was just going to turn off all the bombs. Big bomber shells. We should divert them if you think it'll improve our odds. Why not? Less big AOEs, presumably. Sounds good to me. Big bomber shell flag for disposal. Serves y'all right. Think we've done enough to weaken the robot? All that we can, at least. It's all good. The stage is set. All that's left is the hijack Heidegger's show. I'm still, like, somewhat confused where it would be. Like, that ex extra room. I've not seen any doors on the way up or anything like that. Armory. Hold the phone. Oh, wait. That's where we are, right? Um, yeah, we're in here. Okay. Oh, there's another door. Hold on. I said armory, right? Oh, it's further up. I see. So we're here, I think. Yeah, we're here. We go to B4. We have the boss fight, presumably, and then there's the armory. Yeah, it's going that way. Okay, that's fine. Are we going the wrong? Are we going the wrong way? We're going the wrong way. We've always got to be going up. Yeah, so we're on B5 at the minute. So the next one up should be B4. We're coming up on the exit. Tifa, detonator still in range. We should be good. The moment big boy goes down, you hit that switch. Right. Sounds like a plan, big boy. He is a big boy himself, isn't he, Barrett? Tough, but oh, one of these dudes again. <laughs> I love these things, actually. They're pretty cool. There's two of them. Alrighty. Let's get another ATB charge. Avoid that for a start. Braver does a lot of damage to these guys. Oh, it would do if he didn't dodge it. But... Overcharge him. Do it. And then once we're here, let's get Barrett to do... Yeah, let's do Steel Skin. Why not, right? Tifa doesn't have an ATB yet. Okay. Okay. A bit of an uppercut on bridled strength time. Oh my god, we just walked straight into that. That's not annoying. What have we got here? Overpower, right? We need to be. Whoa, that looks awesome. So yeah, we get proficiency bonus granted every time we use the ability. So we should definitely be using it. Well, if it lands, that is. Can you get down here, please? The sooner we learn the skill, the sooner we can switch to that other weapon, right? Okay, have we missed anything here? No. Onwards and upwards this time. Health's a little bit low. Um, let's just put a Cura on Tifa. Like that. And then heal ourselves as well. Here we go. That'll do. More crates. Give me Moogle medals. Ah, oh, no Moogle medal. Sad face. Is this the boss room then? Okay. I remember coming down here. Got no time to double back. There's two rooms. Oh, I see. So. Let's see here. The armory is that way. Okay. How do we get in here, though? That's the question. I guess we're just gonna go out, huh? Can't say we didn't prepare. Now we just gotta get it done. So basically, we can gain access to the other room when we've done this. Which should be back down there, I think. Presumably. Okay, then. At this point, we should probably make sure everybody is full health, then. 
we're also going to use an ether. We're going to use it on cloud. This healing magic is probably going to be pretty useful here. And we'll do one on Barrett as well, because why not? Okay, so we have Ifrit linked up to this, so... Okay. Hopefully this works. Status report. We're short on BBs. We're tracking down replacements. Work faster, or you'll hear it from the brass. <clears throat> Look, they're still prepping it. They're here! Hold them back! Buy us every second you can! Oh god. Don't take care of these dudes from behind, right? Because they have shields. Oh, they're just bringing lambs to the slaughter. This guy needs to be attacked, actually. He needs to die, right? Goodbye. All oh, right, you. He won't die physically. There's like no health. Okay, that's fine. Triple slash time. Oh wow, you deflected that. That's pretty cool. What did I expect really? I can't move now. Do some damage, boys. This guy's annoying. You're right behind it. Can you just hit him, please? Oh my god. This guy. There we go. What? Looks like a performance assessment, don't you think? We'll figure out its weaknesses as we fight it. As long as we stay focused, we'll be fine. We can do this. For real though, we need to talk victory poses. Something coordinated for the live on camera finish. Could blow up big, start a new trend. Vito. Okay. No way up. So what are we doing? Did the thing get airlifted? Yeah, it did. Okay. I missed that completely because we were fighting. Oh, jeez. What the... F I didn't expect that. I didn't even see that. Oh, damn. I feel bad now. This is like a little mini boss before the boss. Brilliant. How much does this do in terms of damage? That's just quite a lot. Okay, we're bravering you to death. Okay, uppercut time for you. And then we also need to put some Thundara on the cutter itself. That does a ton of damage, doesn't it? Okay, so we are silenced now, apparently. That's fine. Oh my goodness. We gotta switch it up. My turn. I accidentally went into punisher mode there. Wow, this thing is doing damage. Jeez. Can we go through all now? Whew. Okay, let's get some more thunder going. We got Thundara finally on Barrett. End of the line then for the robot. Good night. Bang. There we go. Real subtle invitation. We were gonna bring the trap in with. Is there any loot down here? New. No. New. No. Where is this armory? Am I is this the armory? Oh, I don't know where those disposal things go. That's annoying. Come on, Barrett then. Maybe it unlocks after we defeated the thing in jig. Echo mist, so to cure silence, because the robots are causing silence on us. Ball of ether. Up we go. More of these things. Oof. Carry you quickly. Wow, that didn't do any damage, did it? 
That's fine, Barrett. You just shoot them. Nothing to it. This reminds me of Reactor One now. Quite a lot of similarities. Big boy's going to an execution, all right. We're gonna put him out of his misery while the whole damn city watches. <laughs> we give it our all and we'll win. There it goes, huh? I still don't see any other access ways, perimeter passageway, utility access. Oh, right. So we're actually in the center, right? Because we started on the, the perimeter passageway and we slid down a pipe. I remember. And this is an elevator? Is there a down button in the elevator? We're going to get through this. We're going to make it home. All of us, no exceptions. Right. We don't want to disappoint Marlene. That goes for you too, Cloud. Right? You better give up, big old smile, this time. <laughs> the price is right. <laughs> Destiny. I see you, other door. Why are you red? Ah, uh, that looks like a place that we need to go. We can't get... Can we get back on the elevator? Uh, heading back down? You got shit to do, I won't stop you. But... It's cool if you want to go back, but... For what? Uh, I don't know. I thought that there might be another button. Is it literally just going to take me to where we were? Legitimately has, isn't it? Oh, I'm going to kick myself. Uh, where would it be? <laughs> There's no, like, quest thingy for that either. All right, well, we'll go up. And if we miss it, then I will cry inside. <laughs> no, what we'll do is we'll come out of the elevator and save. And if it turns out I've missed it, I'll load the save up and we'll go back down there. Probably off camera and I'll show you in the next episode what I found there. That could be a good plan. So let's quickly save this. Over there. There we go. Save it over that episode. Oh, any time now would be lovely. Come on, PlayStation. There we go. Chapter 7. I still think it's through there, personally. That you can get in here if you you know, defeat the boss. But that's just speculation, right? I have no idea. We shall find out together. What? Open it already. It's locked down. Is there any way we can get it open? Yeah, from that room over there. Oh, huh, okay. Why does everything have to be so damn complicated? You know, the faulty equipment storerooms that way too. Ah! Do you think we'll find the components we diverted there? It's like a treasure vault. Woo, I like the sound of that. <laughs> okay, I don't have to do any saves coming. It's fine. So, how do we do this? It's simple, really. We move the levers at the same time. Got these ones. I'll take left. Which just leaves right, soldier boy. Okay. Let's do it. Locks can be disabled by simultaneously operating levers located on security panels. Barrett and Cloud's levers are operated by L and R respectively, and Tifa, at Tifa's signal, push L and R in the direction shown on the display. Emergency lockdown is currently in effect. So we need to synchronize our movements? In that case, follow my lead. Nah, Tifa's. Fine, have it your way. Okay. Okay, pay attention, you two. Three, two, one. Up. Try to match my timing, oh. okay? <laughs> okay. Good. Focus. Three, two, two one. one. Up. Emergency lockdown disengaged. Okay. Gotcha. Now that is what I call teamwork. Go team. I wonder if we had failed that deliberately, if we'd got an extra scene. There's another one here, isn't there? 
Interesting. Open sesame? This would be the treasure vault. That's right. What's the catch? Need to bypass a high level security lock. Different from the other one? Same deal. But we gotta do it several times. Ooh. <laughs> Tight wads. But hearing that just makes me wanna rob a more. Yeah, let's stick it to him. Let's do it. Sounds like a plan. Okay. Let's try and do it this time. Security lockdown is currently in effect. Okay, guys. You know what we have to do. Yep. Copy me? No, Tifa leads. Oh, fine. After you, girl. Gotta get past level one right. first, right? Three, two, two one, up. Oh. oh, that one's down. Move yours the same way as mine. I didn't see the other bit. So one's up, one's down. Got it. We got this. Three, two, one. Wait, I did that. Shit. Didn't I? Shake it off. Three, two, one. <laughs> I'm, uh, still getting older. <laughs> I pushed his down. We got this. Three, Three two, two, one. one. Jeez, oh, that is tight. That was great, you guys. Let's keep it up. Okay. Keep going. All right. Three, two, two one, one, up. Don't rush it. I didn't. Focus. Three, Three two, two, one. one. I pushed him up. Um, breathe when I breathe. We got this. Three, Three two, two, one. one. There we go. That is tight. It looks wow. easy, but it's not. Think we've got this? Hell yeah! Bring it on! Ain't nothing I love more than sticking it to Shinra. What's next? Halfway there. Steady, guys. Three, Three two, two, one. one. Level Look at that. Like a pro. No way! You guys are naturals. What, pulling levers? I agree. Okay, final round. Don't lose focus. Three, Three two, two, one. one. Easy peasy. Delta level security. Disengaged. Disposal room now accessible. Take that, Shinra. Making us jump through hoops to steal your shit. Didn't take as long as I expected. Good work, guys. Likewise. You made it easy. <laughs> I put my heart and soul into those countdowns. <laughs> it may look easy, guys, but that was actually really weird timing. It wasn't as she said. You had to actually time it um, a little differently. What is this, then? We got an achievement. Magic up materia. Lovely, lovely. That's always nice to see. Um, weren't we supposed to get some loot? Yes, we were. Hold. Give me that loot. Three bombs, right? I think that's what should be coming down. Score. It's just like Four bombs. They say a job well done is on your wall. I say take everything that ain't nailed down. Literally what I said in episode one. Couldn't agree more. Right, what have we got here? Big bomber. So we actually got these as items. Oh my goodness. Two bottles of ether. And what's this? Another big bomber. So we've got three big bombers and a bottle of ether. I wish I'd gone for uh, four big bombers now. Not really sure what they do, apart from, well, bomb things. Let's see. Oh, well, we have a lot of items. 500 physical damage to enemies within range. That's actually not that much, um, unfortunately. But we got a loot, right? And we got an achieve, and we had some fun. So let's carry on and uh, go for the main boss. Which is through here. Ooh, music. I want it. Give me the music. Oh, the bombing mission. Brilliant. We'll buy that. We're okay for potions, actually. Um, is there any way of selling them? No. Well, maybe. But we'll have a look in a second. Phoenix Downs are on offer. Let's buy another one of those. Not used a single one yet. Got mega potions. We'll take three of those. Uh, Echo Mist. Don't really need any more of those, I don't think. Some bracelets. 
Uh, we can buy another one of those. I mean, they're pretty cool. Uh, yeah, magic damage. Let's just buy buy two of those for 3,200 gil. I know it sounds like a lot, but honestly, gil's not been too bad so far. MP up. Uh, I mean, we don't own a poison material, right? So let's get one anyway. And that'll do. We can sell stuff. Okay, here we go. I want to sell a few of these. Oh, we can only sell nine. Oh no, there we go. So we can sell, let, let's sell, let's sell 79 of, no, let's, let's sell 80 of them um, for 2000 gil. That's not a lot, but we don't need that many, do we? And let's heal up on this bench that's conveniently placed before a boss. Hmm. <laughs> ah, what an endeavor. This has been stretched out way more than the original, and I'm fine with that. Okay, give me the crates. No Moogle medals, though. Wah. My sad noises. Wah. Okay, let's, uh, can we go fight a boss now? Please. There we go. Oh, God. This does look familiar, actually. The original boss we fought on one of these platforms, so... Yeah. Huh? Huh? Look! More drones. Oh, oh. The eyes of one who has vindicated model, which would make you... A soldier. X soldier. Once a soldier, always a soldier. Though not, alas, for very long. Accelerated cellular degradation being the most common cause of death by far. This is classified, of course, but every soldier knows the truth. That's right. Think you for getting someone? <laughs> Would that I could. You strike me as the type to go on without air. Ain't enough hours in the day to hold you to account for all your crimes. And what a wasteful indulgence it would be, even if there were. Okay, then. Let's talk about wasteful indulgences. What is Marco? The life stream. The lifeblood of the planet. Our planet. But Shinra keeps on slurping it up like a thirsty dog. What do you think's gonna happen if you don't stop, huh? Mm hmm We do indeed keep on slurping it up, as you say. But for whose benefit, I wonder. The true nature of Marco is known to one and all, yet the people willfully turn a blind eye to the cost. As you must surely be aware. Don't you dare try to put this on us! If anyone's going along with your plans, it's because you brainwashed them! Such methods are beneath me. As are you, my faithful sewerettes. Henceforth, allies of wicked Wutai, our sworn enemy. Thank you for stoking our people's patriotic fervor. Unbelievable. Wutai. You still don't understand your role in this. What are they doing? Don't you see? You fools were never in control. Never anything but pawns in our plans to sell great and glorious war to the people. And your instruments of insurrection will detonate. Uh. When we so choose. God damn it! Now let us raise the curtain on our main event! Here it comes! The trial of the eco extremist group Avalanche! Very conspired with Mukai and Midgar! Your guilt is undeniable! Your punishment, death! I'm sick of this. 
I'm sick of all of this. It's just like it, right? but I failed you. Cloud, get your head in the game. We're counting on you, man. Oh god, here we go. So the original fight with this, you used to actually attack it from behind, and that was its weak point. This music is amazing. Oh my god. Those who fight further. Brilliant. Uh, we also have 21 minutes to beat this, so let's have fun. Oh, little grenades there. Oh jeez. You can't do big bomber because there's no bombs. <laughs> uh, take that. Okay, Thundara it is. Right in the ass. Okay, Cloud, you've got a uh, opening there, my friend. You should actually um, assess this as well. Okay, weakness lightning. La uh, lightning attacks rapidly fill its stagger gauge. Yeah, I mean, it drops a titanium bangle. This music is rocking. Let's kick its ass. No holding back. Uh, Tifa, you're up. Fundara, please. Oh, jeez. <laughs> oh, my God. That knockdown attack, though. See spells, more Thundara, please. So long. Get ready. You see by the fraction of this machine's true capabilities. Yeah. Show me how fast you can run. Oh, I can run pretty fast. Yeah, you didn't want to stand in that, Barrett. Um, I'm just letting you know that. Yeah, it don't stand in it. We, need to come up with a plan. we have a plan. It's called lightning it to death. Oh, we need mana. Okay. Uh, another ether for you, Barrett. Let's go. Tifa doesn't have limit uh, thingy up yet. What we need to do is use a high potion on Barret right now. Okay, Tifa, can you do um, Bandara again, please? It's nearly staggered. It's nearly there. A little bit more. A little bit more. A little bit more. There we go. Right, let's unleash. Let's take care of them first. Okay, Cloud, Barrett, Tifa doesn't have a thingy yet. We need to use this opportunity though. Whilst we have it, whilst it's staggered, we need to do as much damage as physically possible. Ow, come on. Right, Barrett, you need to fill in the blanks here. I know we're supposed to avoid that, but it's melee range, and that's kind of annoying. Um, you're low on... Let's just use that on you, the elixir. Oh, God. Okay, there we go. She has no LB. Uh, what can we summon? We can summon Chocobo and Moogle. Let's go. Get up. Not seen this one yet. Yeah. <laughs> Kick their ass. Please. Oh, for goodness sake. So it protected it. We need to take care of these dudes, don't we really? Like the hands. Oh, for goodness sake. This is not good. Can we fill your meter, please? Moogle Blast. 
do it. Okay, now we need to actually start healing, I think. Yeah. Let's get uh, Kiraga on the go for Cloud first. That was very well timed. These hands! Oh my god. Stop stunning me! For goodness sake. Okay. Summon ability. Just Moogle Blast it, please. So annoyingly hard to avoid that stuff. should have tried to destroy the damn arms at this point. The stun. Brilliant. ATV gauge is just not fulfilling, is it? Can we even reach it? Yes, we can. We staggered the arm. How wonderful. Stampede! Kick his ass. Oh my god. That does a lot of damage. Wow. And so it should, really. Alright, so that's one hand destroyed. Are we doing... What the... That doesn't look good. <laughs> um... Time to do your thing, big man. I'm not sure we can actually hit that sure with a limit back, break. Right. This. I'm not going out like this. Can it come closer? At all? Deal with that. Basically, it's just Barrett show then. Okay. We're going to use as much Vandara as possible, right? Get out of the bomb. And he's stunned. Okay. Cloud, I need you to do your limit break, please. Whilst he's in range. Lovely. Pressured a little bit. Okay. More. More needed. Uh, Tifa, I need you to unload with some... Damn, we have no uh, ether. Nuts. There's lasers, though. How are we doing, Barrett? Can you help? Yes, you can. Okay, spell on you. Then we need Cloud to use his Braver again, because it does a lot of damage. Get away from those bombs as best we can. Even though we're being stunned, of course. Another Thundara in the face, my friend. Come on, let us move. Overcharge. We're doing tons of damage to this. No panicking is needed. Let's just use an elixir. I really cannot be bothered to use these. Uh, oh my god. Cannot be bothered to use these damn ethers that do nothing. Need to do some serious amounts of damage with thunder. Okay, right, we have two charges of that. Let's unload. Dodge roll, please. And then another one to the face. Can Cloud do anything? I mean, you can cast Fire, right? Fire Arg is pretty useful. It's not going to be a weak point, but... It's better than nothing. Okay, Tifa, you have... Well, let's, let's just use a Thunder. We're using so much magic here, it's ridiculous. Thundara. Ah, of course, he's bloody stopped. Go punish it mode, because he's in... Thingy has run out of the tank buster though. Oh, Tifa is just dead. Brilliant. Can you just uh, build that up and get Tifa back up? Because she does a lot of damage actually. Significant. Our first Phoenix down of the game on Tifa. Be careful. 
My fault, to be honest. I mean, it was plenty of times to heal. I just chose not to. There we go. Wow, that really does heal quite a lot, doesn't it, Tifa? Jeez. It's getting there. It's nearly done for. It's getting desperate. Look, we've still got 16 minutes on the uh, on the thingy, but we're not going to even need 16 minutes. Let's just finish it off with some good old... I ah, didn't even need to. There's the titanium bangle that we were after. Not the cleanest to kill, but I'll take it. We don't have long to get clear. Take Tifa and get out of here. I, I was wrong about you. This ain't the end of the line for you or me. Cloud! Ah! Come on! <laughs> Uh-oh. Well then. <laughs> that happened in the original, but... Oof. Now we get to an interesting bit of the game. Yay! Ah oh dear. That was an interesting fight, though. I made that look terrible. But we were way ahead of a timer. Way ahead of it. And as much as I didn't dodge roll out of everything, I didn't think I needed to necessarily. It was just about pumping it with as much lightning as possible. Anyway, I'll shut up now for a second. Something, anything, anything. Why not? Good, good. Easy does it. Slow, slow. And steady. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> hey, uh, who are you? <laughs> who are you? I am. You're everything. Uh, hello in there. Oh, Cloud. There's still so much to be done. Chapter 8 time. Maybe you're not okay. <sighs> ah, he lives. Finally awake, are we? You're... Aerith. It's Aerith. And you are? Cloud. Nice to meet you again. Again, huh? What? You don't remember? What about the flowers? Oh, the flower girl. And this is... An old church in the Sector 5 slums. You came crashing through the roof without so much as a lookout below. <laughs> Fell right into my flower bed. Lucky for you. Like, really. Oh, oh, sorry, I, I didn't mean to... Don't worry about it. They're a lot tougher than they look. This place, it has a kind of power. Before I forget, you dropped this when you landed. Thanks. I've got one, too. You and everybody and their mother. Not like mine, no. It's special. Mine's not good for anything at all. Bet you just don't know how to use it. Could be. Though... I really don't mind. Just having it is enough. It was a gift from my mother. 
Pretty crazy, huh? Us meeting again like this. You should stay a while. <laughs> Can I stay here forever, Aerith? <laughs> Is that possible? Oh man, look at the... Look at the beautiful flowers. Just when I had finished tending the flowers here. Gotta start over. Oh. Just me, myself, and I. I'm sorry, did I walk on them too much? Sorry about that. Um, yeah. So, wow, I mean, last time we saw this was Advent Children, if you've watched that movie. A lot of people have very mixed opinions on Advent Children. I personally think it's a amazing, especially the complete edition. I always find it weird that you, uh, you immediately find the normal version on the internet, but not the complete edition. Although I do know on the PSN store, they've replaced... Uh, the original version with a complete edition. It just doesn't say. But it is definitely worth watching it. I could stick around a bit. <gasps> really? You will? In that case. Huh? Oh yeah. Thanks. <clears throat> and who are you? He's my bodyguard. And a soldier. Pretty cool, huh? Huh? A soldier? Ex-soldier. Well, what do you know? You've got the eyes, at least. <laughs> you don't mind, do you? Bodyguard work's not too different from merc stuff, right? Huh? Uh, I guessed. From the sword. Just do this for me, okay? <sighs> Fine, but it'll cost you. A lot. A lot, huh? One date ought to do it. Huh? Huh. Well, you're weird enough to be one. What class? <laughs> First. <laughs> if you're gonna bullshit me, at least try to make it believable. <laughs> hey, watch the flowers! You heard the lady. <laughs> Make this quick. You better. Here we go. I don't want to fight on the flowers. Oh, the healing. Oh no, don't go on the flowers. Oh, I'm so sorry, Aerith. I'm sorry. We're kind of going on your flowers a bit here. Don't hate me. Oh, I keep missing this stuff. I'm trying desperately to not go on the flowers. Exactly, you see? Do we have to fight near the flowers? That's my question. Just quick braver in the face should do. I'll deal with you, my friend. And then chopping day. Where are you? Oh, you're over there. Why would you need help, Reno? Was never your style. This guy's getting wrecked. Good night. Come on, Reno, give us a fight. Good old what's his face. I'm damn good at it! Best character still, after all these years. Come on, then, Reno. Oh my goodness. Sloppy? No. You did not just say sloppy. How dare you? How dare you? Oh my goodness. Damn, you're fast, Reno. Flippin' hell. How are you dodging everything? <laughs> what is this? No. Nope.
So his only weakness is when he's charging an ability. Seriously? It's kind of crap. Oh my god. What on earth? This is actually really, really quite a surprise. A pleasant one. Not healing at that point was a bad idea. Come on. Keep forgetting to block. There we go. It's been a while since I've actually blocked, I'll be honest. Damn it. I'm waiting. Okay. Damn it, Reno. Stop it. I'm trying to raise my shield. I'm fine. I have Kiraga. What do you have, Reno? I'm trying to dodge roll here. That's not working for me. You're just not used to blocks, are you? Bring it. I'm coming for you. What's up? He just hates me when I block. Come on. Then. Come on. It was your best shot. Okay, that was your best shot. Damn, that hurt. So we just need to block you, and then mm, that wasn't the right one, was it? Okay, and then limit break you. There we go. That's what we're after, right there. Gonna make me work for it, huh? Well, lucky for you, top guy. Consummate professional. Figured this dance of ours could use a spark. Jesus, I don't really particularly want to have a spark in the face. Oh. Now I've got to get rid of those mines if I can. Oh my god, stunned into a mine. That's not good. Let me, let me move, damn it. Okay, we've got an ATB, so we have to cure now. Damn it, Reno, you're stronger than I thought. I like this. Well, you're fairly weak, but I'm bad at the game, so... No, I want to kill that mine. It's annoying me. No, I'm trying my hardest to not get wrecked by you. No, 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 no. Now hit you. Need a braver. There we go. And a miss. What a miss. <sighs> Should time the block. Oh my god. These mines are so annoying. <laughs> And I didn't time that at all, did I? Nope. Really? That does so much stun from so far away? Unbelievable. Love the way he whips them, though. That's pretty cool. For goodness sake. I was doing alright earlier, and now I'm sucking. Okay. I am trying to watch my step. For goodness sake. Oh, for goodness sake. Right. Uh, we can only cure... Let's just use a high potion on you. Okay, Reno. 
How did that hit? Are you kidding me? Oh, come on. That's a little bit annoying now. Okay. How did that not fully heal you? Are you kidding me? Fucking mines. No. Oh. <laughs> How? At that range? Are you kidding me? Okay, Mega Potions. They don't even heal you to full, that's crazy. I thought that they would, but... You don't even have an ATB charge for you, do we? Nope. Oh, come on. Well, well. Okay. You're gonna catch holy hell. Oh, not more bloody mines. More things. And I didn't raise my... I'm trying so hard to block. I don't want to get hit by the flail. Okay. Limit break time. There we go. I sucked so hard on that. You've got it all wrong, man. I just wanted to. What on earth? Get the girl. Sir! The hell? Weird. They're not attacking. Hey! Open it up! Come on. Over here! There's material over there as well. That's annoying. Can I not get through these? Nope. Huh? Are they trying to stop us? Yeah, they're trying to stop me from getting the materia at the moment. I wonder if some of these are good and some of them are bad. Maybe we can get out that way. Right. Through that hole. Right. Yeah. That's not unusual. I'll go first. Come on. Scratch on her, you're done. Sir! We bring her in, in one piece. <laughs> what now? <laughs> Run! <laughs> Move and I'll shoot! Oh no, you won't. But sir! <clears throat> We're gonna drop that? the chandeliers. <laughs> Okay, so we have to follow this. 
What we should have done is gone that way then. This is pretty cool. And then turn, right? And then this way. And then across there. Like this. Run. Okay. Stop her. Where are we going now? Okay. Over there. Can't actually get to that chandelier. Maybe we're supposed to just come over here and jump down. Where? Over where? Oh, over there. Okay. On my way. On my way. I thought we were going to a little attic place. Don't mind me just soaking some bullets in the face. Well, and the ass at the moment. This way. Go to hell. Screw you. Can we hop down from here? Or does it have to be in that specific point? Yeah, it's got to be there. Come on in. You're welcome. Cloud, give me a hand. I'm working on it. I'm holding the button. That's a heavy bookcase, damn. Guess we go up then, huh? Not sure how we're supposed to get that materia, but we'll come back for it. They're in the attic. Should we pursue? Got it. We are out. <clears throat> Beginner's luck. More of those things. It's like they're guiding us. Stay close. <gasps> so cool. Huh. Is there any way of us going back down to get that loot? No. Okay, so we'll have to come back later then. That's that's not a problem. I'm not really sure why it was stopping us from getting it, but. We'll get it in the end, don't worry. My OCD is flickering just as much as it is yours. This place looks amazing now, though. Get this loot, whatever this is. Package of smelling salts. Well, that presumably brings people back from being asleep. Need to stay ahead of them. Oh, yeah, the rafters. Or not. Is there any loot on any of these? No. Yeah, I think so. What are they? I think. Actually, I don't know. Let's just go. Oof. Now we get to go across the favelas of the slums again. Look at this place. Wow. Now this is what I remember. Damn, looks so cool. Okay. Up for crossing the rooftops? See that pillar over there? There's a station right by it. Shall we mosey on over? Let's. Sounds like a plan to me. Is there any extra stuff, though? Not that I see. I'm sure there'll be lots of secrets to go and collect. When we get access to the church again, I will come back and I will grab the loot. So, Don't worry. What's next for you? A little bit of bodyguard work. <laughs> right. After that, it's back to the Sector 7 slums. You know how to get there? Yep. Of course you do. Okay, up we go. Oh, look at the little pigeonies. Hello, pigeons. I can't slash them, sadly. Or is it a dove, actually? I'm not sure. Eh, doves, pigeons. Ah, I see you, loot. How do I get to you? I shall find a way. It's like there's a way up there as well, but it's blocked. That suit from earlier. He was one of Shinra's Turks. What's a Turk want with you? Dunno. Hey, don't Turks keep an eye out for potential soldiers and stuff? They do more than just scout for candidates. Turks get called in to handle all kinds of situations with extreme prejudice. <laughs> Professional bad guys. Gotta love them. Back to my question. So what's he to you? Looked like you knew each other. 
Maybe he thought I could be the greatest soldier yet. Forget it. Hmm? <laughs> you mad? He's always mad. Okay. This way to get the loot, please. Thank you. Give me that sweet, sweet chest. What's inside here? Big ol' metal! Woo! Yay! I think we're, about, we're up to 12 now. I think something like that. Look how beautiful this place is. I mean, in a different kind of way, right? It's a trash heap, but it's a beautiful trash heap. I have love for everything in this game, especially of the trash. Man, it was no different in the original. Only there's more of it now, look. <laughs> Way more. Lots of secrets to be hidden in it, no doubt. As to be expected. Careful. Not a lot of room. Gotcha. Thanks. Come on then. Let's go over. It's only a pipe. I guess we could fall and die off of here, but... What's the chances of that happening? Just to have Aerith's theme playing in the background is quite nice. Makes you feel really homely. I actually haven't traveled by rooftop before. Be surprised if you had. It's honestly kind of exciting. Well, first time and all. Wow, look at that. That view is amazing with the pillar there below the reactor, and then that's where we fell, presumably. The big hole. Actually, no, the hole's the other side, isn't it? That's a different hole entirely. Any holes, deal with it. Okay, down we go. I'm always looking for loot. If it looks like I'm staggering this, it's because I am. I'm sort of delaying so I can look for anything that I might miss. That's how I play these games, right? You've, you've seen that by now. I'm sure you'd be the same if you played it. But maybe some of you won't be like that. I don't know. Okay, over we go. Well, that's the destination. Look at those... What are those uh, office buildings? Interesting. I can't move the camera that far. Oh, you need help? Oof. Don't just run off on your own. I'm sorry. The words of a soldier candidate. So petty. Ah, oh dear. Up we go. Let's see if there's any more loot up here. Aha! My loot senses are tingling, as they say. So what is this? Part of a barn or something? So this was once like farmland, maybe? At one point? Before they built the, uh... The big rotting pizza in the sky, so to speak. So does no one live in these buildings? Nope. No one to get mad if we make noise. Yeah, I think it's pretty much derelict now, dude. It's kind of crazy to think, though, isn't it? Like, this could be farmland at one point of time in the past, and then it's like a bustling community with a church and the rocks around it with a natural landmass, and then they built that. It's just... It's like Independence Day levels of, wow, look at that size spaceship sort of thing, isn't it? The big lanterns there for the artificial light when it's nighttime. Absolutely crazy. It looks kind of rusty. I'll go first. It's pretty old. Be careful. Okay. <sighs> Easy now. You worry too much. I'm not some princess who needs to be coddled. Shit. <laughs> Are you sure about that? <clears throat> the timing. Whew. That was unexpected. Thank you, Cloud. <sighs> huh. There it is. The wall. The wall? The wall of junk? 
four. Oh, there, the wall. Wow, jeez. The wall of Midgar. So even if you're in here, it's so hard to get out of Midgar, isn't it? It's pretty much like a prison. Weird. You know, I thought about leaving once, but in the end, I couldn't. Too dangerous? Too much. A whole world bursting with life. Maybe more than I can handle, I think, sometimes. Even now. People hate the steel sky, the slums, but I don't. How could I? All that passion, all those dreams, glowing and blending together into something greater. She has a point in a weird artistic way. Yeah, look at that. That is absolutely insane. But it's so wasteful, isn't it, as well? I really have destroyed the, the environment to make this. I always was in awe of this game back then. Just because of the, the, the concepts, damn it. Like, the size of this thing. But now we get this 3D version. It just... It paints such a bigger picture. It's... This is honestly turning in to be... First. After all, I can't count on you to wait. Sure about this? See for yourself. Hmm. Maybe I'll go on ahead and leave you all by your lonesome. Just... Uh, maybe you shouldn't talk. Then you talk. Tell me a story. As I was going to say, this is turning into one of my favorite games so far. I really don't want to interrupt anybody either. Let's see what the story is then. All right, we, we were too close. There we go. Not for free. Cheapskate. You're... Ah! 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 Oh. Ah! 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 Huh. Gotcha. You're killing me here. Killing the both of us. Oof. You're precious, Aerif. You don't realize, do you? Here goes nothing. Oh God. Woo! This looks like fun, actually. Oh. That would have been bad if it was a nail just there. We would have been split in two. Do you realize that? Oof. Not something you should try in real life at all. I know a guy who did something similar to that and he ended up with uh, massive cuts down his back. He went down a slide in some like abandoned place. Weird. She going to be able to make that jump, dude? You good? Of course. My hero. Never a dull moment with you. That a compliment? Uh, not really. <laughs> Thanks anyway. Oh god, here we go. Aerith joins the party. Station. Even so, we'll probably run into a few monsters on the way. Hmm. Huh. There's a face that screams, so what? Eh, I fought scarier things in my sleep. Can we just for a second appreciate this music? I believe this uh, track was originally called Underneath the Rotting Pizza. It's one of my favorite pieces of music in the original game. Just listen to that bass line. <laughs> it's beautiful. And... Oh, I need the full soundtrack to this game. My deluxe edition came with a soundtrack, like a mini one. This is not on it. Okay, let's go back to the church, right? <laughs> Where are you going, Cloud? Aww. I was tempted to get that materia, Aerith. What do you expect me to do? Just leave it there? Ah, <sighs> in the future. Man, I'm so glad they've done this track, though. This is exactly what makes Final Fantasy VII such an iconic game. The soundtrack is like nine tenths of the process for me. Look out, Cloud. Oh, oh, it's a hedgehog pie. Oh, those things were added. Oh my god, look at this thing. These things are so weird. They were added in the original. 
we're going to start seeing some of the more unusual uh, monsters from this game. Someone looks like they're in their element. That's a lot of fun, actually. I need to scan all of these monsters. Oh, look, part of a tank turret, of course. Of course there is, next to a massive dump truck thing. And, ah, oh, it's so cool. And what's behind crate number two? An antidote. Lovely. You just want to crawl on this stuff and explore, don't you? Maybe that's just the inner hoarder in me or something. It's like an arm there from a big robot. Oh. My imagination raced when I was a child looking at this stuff. It's racing again here, I'll be honest. Look at that. What is that for? That's what I used to ask myself. What is this for? What is that for? What would that crane be used for? I used to create little stories in my head. This was just a catalyst for it all. Okay, we've got some more mobs up ahead. Don't see any loot. So this time, that's where we're at. We don't have to worry about that. Let's make sure before we kill this, we assess the hedgehog pie. I want to read it. Mischievous creature found throughout the slums. They first came to Midgar in search of food and have proliferated since. They attack by charging into foes with the spines on their back and by casting spells. Ice attacks rapidly fill their stagger gauge, knocking them off balance, causes them to rampage, making them harder to stagger and they're weak to ice. And are also weak to a sword in the face. That looks it. That works. So, Cloud, you don't know the slums that well, do you? Compared to you? No. Training grounds, barracks, battlefields. That's the world I know. <laughs> you sound proud of that. Uh. It's a life. There's a Moogle medal. Lovely jubbly. Thank you kindly. Ooh. Oh, I thought it was something that we could get into, but it's just backdrop. Any loot? Or is this just oh, more lovely junk? Just want to grab a hold of some of it and look at it and try and figure out what it was originally for. As a kid, I used to take things apart. I, used to, I think I was given a screwdriver by my dad and used to take everything apart I saw. I don't know why. It just, it's one of those weird things I used to do. Just to see how things worked. Look at that. That's awesome. I said I wasn't going to get sidetracked, but... It's impossible, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. What's that? I don't know. Big crane here with pneumatic drill press oil? Oil drilling platform? Not really sure what else that could be used for. Like a silo number 67, 68. So this is next to the... Ah. Is that the Turks helicopter? Or just, yeah, lots of Shinra helicopters with guns on them. Shinra construction forklift there. Some more Station. crates to destroy. Oh, thought the world you knew didn't include stations. Ha ha. <laughs> it's a love-hate relationship, Cloud, but you'll learn to love her, don't worry. Damn, look at this place. I just want to explore all of it, damn it. <laughs> This is happening. If you would all just please calm down. Hey, what the hell's going on? Shut it out, Come Mom. on. There's no need to shout. Popular place. Yeah. Well, it's got a good view of the reactor. It's on fire! In a show. They know that. Don't worry. Oh, didn't expect to see you here. Huh? I don't see the fire. On your way home from the church? That's right. Well, I'm glad you're okay. Did any debris hit the church? Not debris, no. That's something at least, but you may not be so lucky next time. Where is it then? Where's the reactor that's on fire? You know a way to get topside other than the train? Sorry, can't say I do. Figured as much. What a goddamn pain in the ass. Interesting. I can't see the reactor that's on fire, but there's loot, so. Give me the loot. 500 gil, that sounds nice to me. How was the inspection? Didn't have the staff. And they're not gonna send us more help? Doesn't look like it. Huh. 
Can we inspect the train ourselves, if you know what I mean? Like, check the loot. Yeah, there's going to be no energy, is there? No, no power being provided. This moron. Can we see it from here? Oh yeah, because they're blaming Wu Tai, aren't they? Supposedly. Anyway, let's get some music. What can we get from you? Kate, uh, Catchy's theme. Well, that's funky. I want that. What else we got here? Smelling salts, echo mist. No new materia. Eh, nothing too important. Oh well. Uh, and we're... No, we're not doing fine for health. Never mind then. Let's rest up. I guess Reno did more damage than I expected him to. There's a surprise. That fight was quite fun, actually. I made it look terrible, but it was a lot of enjoyment coming from my side. What's down here? Can I get past these guys? Nope. My man. Let's go. Another Turk. A real man on a mission. On the hunt, more like. For me or you? Don't know. Don't care. Then. Let's stick to the back streets. Ah, there will be monsters. <laughs> There's always monsters. But I kind of wanted to explore that way, Cloud. Now we're exploring. Aww. More stuff to revisit than Aerith. Damn. How about a bowl of shut your mouth, woman? Ah, oh dear. I don't want no stew hates you actually in real life there's a factoid for you if you didn't know that there's a shinra dump site up ahead not the kind of place anyone would ever choose to hang around in but a great place to lay low yep more crates oh back to the rotting pizza music lovely They've got the run Ooh, a weir rat i killed enough of these i don't need to scan them There we go. Lovely. Oh, did I miss one? I did miss one. I must have called for help, right? That's one of their moves. Okay. Monsters instinctively target weaker prey. You'd better watch out then, Cloud. Wow. Rude. <laughs> but not wrong. Oh, it's these things again. Hi there. I'm pretty good at protecting myself, you know. It's gonna avoid their feast attack, haven't we? If I remember. Gotta wrestle with the camera at the same time, though. There we go. Which way? Uh, left or right? Well, I'm going this way, right? That way is a dead end. That's fine. Some construction, but quit halfway. Okay, what were they building? Another pillar? This smells like loot opportunities to me. Oh wow, what are those rockets? What on earth were they building or trying to build here? These are like gun casings. What, the f what on earth? Oh yeah, that's definitely a rocket booster. Wow. Is this like a failed test site for their uh, space agency? That we'll see later on in the game. Spoilers, I guess. 
Yeah, there's nothing down there. Interesting. Unless that's a scene where we fight somebody later. I don't know. Kind of cool, though. I'm glad we explored it. So this way it is. Past all of the cranes and cutting tool equipment that's broken. So wasteful, but I Over love it. Here. I want to break the crates, though. See? Moogle medals. We need them. No loot? Any loots behind this strangely marked thing? No? Okay, onwards we go. Pull a lever, please. Thank you. That didn't work. Maybe it's broken? Pretty sure this path we're on loops around too, so. Huh. A discovery opportunity. Maybe. Can we use a crane to move it? Or I guess we could just shove it, right? Damn, I forget that Cloud is quite a strong fellow. I knew it. I'll do. In we go. There must be a way back down round here then to open that gate. It says discovery opportunity, and I would love to take part in that. Hmm, there's no path, though. Although there is clearly a path down there where it's not showing us. Hmm. Well, it must be back round and then you'll open it from the other side. I'm going to dwell on it too much. Any monsters? The pathway that way. Oh, hedgehogs. Out of nowhere. Group of them. Right, this sounds like a triple slash opportunity. Yeah. Weaklings. It's nice to actually fight something that's uh, not really fighting back for a change. How do you figure? Because they went for the stronger prey. Brilliant. Oh, I love the back and forth commentary. It's so cool. Okay, up we go, right? So this should take us to the other side of that gate, in theory. What's this way? Um, okay. Is this the destination or is the other thing the destination? I'm not sure, but we'll find out. There's loot over here, so... That's a thing. Calig Caligneus bracelet. Which is... What is a Caligneus bracelet? It is a bracelet manufactured by Shinra designed for efficient material usage. So it has like no attack and no magic attack. It's got five, def uh, yeah, five physical and five magic defense with three slots. That's pretty cool. We'll figure that into our build in a little bit. So the only way is the other way then. Okay. There's no other thing we can get to that direction. Interesting. Maybe the other side of that gate is actually in town. Unless it loops all the way around. It could do. But we're not going to get to it by this way because they won't let us. Yeah, so we have to carry on. Sounds like a plan. Through the hole it is. Man, I used to get so anxious listening to this music back in the day. Used to get my heart pumping for some reason. I don't know. It's just very high tension music, isn't it? The original version, like the MIDI track, there, was just... The heart of the slums. <laughs> oh, look at all that rubbish. Jeez. Still a fair ways off. Well, we did take a detour. Getting tired? No. Me? I'm feeling a bit hungry. How about you? Amazed. You're in for a treat when we make it back. Don't have time for that. You'll want to make time for my mom's cooking. And that's the final word on it. 
We'll get home quick and eat ourselves stupid. Sounds like a plan, Aerith. Why not? I want to try some of your mum's cooking for certain. Oh, look at that spooky, spooky hole full of metal and circular saws and all the sorts of things that would give you... I mean, honestly, walking through here, I feel like I need a tetanus shot. There's tanks. Oh, look at that tank. That's so cool with, like, four barrels. Wow. Nice. Wrecked little cars and stuff. All the stuff that they don't want up there gets thrown down here, doesn't it? If I remember correctly. All the machinery, the construction equipment. They just keep building and building on the same pile of rubbish. Until the rubbish itself is like the foundations. Okay, we got a hedgehog and one of those gorges. Try to stay Two of those gorges. Let's take care of the gorges first. That one's casting feast. We don't want to be hit by that. Triple slash. Sounds like a plan. There we go. Take care of that. And then you're dead already. Lovely. Okay, so we have another split path. This is a dead end, I think. So let's check that out. Or is it a dead end? Not sure. Probably not. Oh yeah, this is this is not the way to go. Big arena though. This is definitely a boss arena, surely. What else could it be? No doubt we'll be coming back here at some point. It's not too spacious to uh to reason that. Okay. It's pushing us in one direction, so let's go. A lot of people have said that as well, like the game's way too linear. Well, the original game was the most linear thing until after Midgar, right? Where you could fly around, but it was still a narrative that you had to follow. So they're only replicating that. But they've added so much extra stuff to it, we can't be really too keyed off about it. Look at that engine, that's awesome. Or generator, one of the two. Or both. This is a path that way. I want to know what's over here. Probably some more loot. Good job we can do these monkey bar um, movements, isn't it? Lovely. Loot. Give me that loot. All that for a remedy, but, you know, I'll take it. Why not, right? Down we hop. Okie dokie. Let's go, Aerith. I'm going to get horribly sidetracked otherwise if you don't push me in the correct direction. Look at those robots. Wow. Wow, those, those things are huge. Can I wield one of them? <laughs> okay, so we've got a gated section up here. What's this then? Barbed wire and stuff. The door is locked. That materia though. All of those crates and... Oh my goodness, this is like a treasure trove. Okay, we need the key for that. However, we get that. That's our main mission now. Doesn't matter what else happens in the game. We need that loot. If it's the last thing I do. Open sesame. There we go. Okay. So we've progressed the main storyline. We've gone around the gate. That is where that... Oh. Is this a mini boss? Jeez. Oh, that's so cool. Smogger. Ugh. Oh, we got silenced. Okay, let's use the ability assess then, figure out what this actually is. An autonomous robot designed by Shinra. As part of its self-repair protocol, it used nearby scrap metal to put itself back together. It also intermittently emits smog. Hitting it whilst using haywire haze makes it susceptible to staggering. Lightning attacks will fill its gauge faster. So we, if it uses an ability and we uh, hit it harder during that, this smog's going to be annoying. But thankfully, we're not that bothered about using, I mean, it would be cool if we used lightning damage. But honestly, yeah, it's probably easier if we just don't bother. Because it's just going to refill anyway, right? And it doesn't look like it's that much of a taxing fight. As much as I'd love to use the 
stuff, I can just stagger it like this. It's not, it's not putting up much of a fight, right? There we go. Oh, I didn't see the self-destruct. <laughs> I probably should have looked backwards. Okay, one thing we've not looked at yet is um, anything to do with Aerith. So she's using a guard stick here uh, with only one material equipped. A mithril armlet, which has like two slots in it. Uh, what we really need is something that pluses her magical stuff. But we don't really have one of those. You know what? You can get the Caligneus uh, bracelet. And we'll also put magic power 5%, spirit 5%. Spirit could be nice. Yeah, we were saving that for you anyway. If we set the materia, summon materia, you can have the Chocobo Chick. And in terms of what we got here, we've got prayer materia, which uses prayer, which is slight HP, all the way up to rank 5 significant HP restoration. Some of the other things I wouldn't mind giving you the healing materia because uh, we don't have you equipped with that. We need you to be able to use Curaga eventually. Ice materia. Yeah, sure. Refocus. Refocus. Limit break. Ooh, a special limit break, eh? Interesting. And then we have an empty slot. So magic up would be nice. Give her a nice... 5% boost that goes all the way up to 25% so we can get more powerful heals off. So she will be my healing stick of of the actual um of the actual thing. So what have we got here? We have 45 SP to spend. That sounds like something we should actually use. Otherwise she's not going to be that much use to us, is she? So we've got uh maximum health 150 MP. Yeah. She's gonna be our healer, so. MP plus magic attack power. Yep. The more magic attack power we get for you, the better. Um, what else have we got here? Tempest damage, 5%. Physical damage reduction when guarding. Magic damage reduction. New materia slot. New materia slot would be pretty cool, actually. We'll get that. We'll get a 5% attack damage boost. Uh, we don't have enough SP for any of that stuff now. Honestly, a little bit of defense would be good. So let's go with that. Okay, so we have another materia slot. But whilst we're here, um, let's look at Cloud. That is Iron Blade, which we're still wielding. Mostly because we can. Oh, we got a new tree as well. Jeez. So we've got 16 uh, SP to spend. Materia slot, attack power plus 12. Yeah, I'm, I'm going to take as much attack power as possible. So we've used all our SP up. It's grey, which means we can't use any more of that. Um, but we do have another materia slot for Aerith, which is, you know. So what do we want? Yeah, cleansing materia. Yep, that's perfect. The more support role healer stuff, the better. So can we actually get up here? Yeah. So this is that way of opening the shortcut, I suppose. I think that's all it does. Yeah. Oh? No? Yeah, there we go. So now we have a shortcut. Very Dark Soulsy. So if we want to come back this way, we can get there much easier. Instead of going all the way through that stuff. Try to stay behind me. Oh, that hedgehog. It's casting fire, eh? How annoying. Take care of you with a braver. Boom. Done. Let's go. I'm just making sure that I did a scan on each of the mobs. Um, what have we got here? Just a house? Let's have a look. Anyone in? No? No one in? Maybe we were supposed to go that way first. I'm not sure, really. I'm a little confused. But Aerith's not coming, which probably means there's some kind of... Yeah, there'll be loot over here. Oh, I see. So we need to go back down, go up there, and then move the crate over, then hop across, and then hop down. Okay, a little puzzle. Well, not really a puzzle, is it? But to help if I could actually run during half of this. 
Back down. Wow. Three ladders just to get to this place. Okay, up we go. And we'll move a crate further across. Oh, I do love this. All these little, like, side activities. Just make sure that's all the way across. I don't want to have to keep coming back down. Okay, back up we go. Up we go here as well. Yeah, because Aerith isn't able to do the monkey bar thing, is she? For some reason. Not sure why. I'm sure she'd be fine at it. Okay, and then across here. And then... I guess this is how we open the gate, right? Maybe that's what I was supposed to do anyway. Yeah. So there would have been some dialogue probably where it was like, We can't open the gate. It must open from the other side. Or not. Oh no, I was right. Okay. Nice work. Way to think ahead. Yeah, I didn't actually see the dialogue, so maybe that was unique what she said, like way to think ahead. No need for thanks. I'd rather get paid. You're getting paid right now. Huh? Oh. Okay. Uh well, the objective's that way, so we'd be remiss if we didn't check this out. Let's have a quick peek. Anyone here? The door is locked. What's behind there? Just... Can't see Aerith, damn it. I'm trying to peer over my monitor. That doesn't work. There is, like, a bench to rest at as well. Okay, something for extra again. Let's have a little look-see. Was that a chest that I could break? No, okay. Couldn't really see, it was very dark. Should be encountering uh, that member of a Turk soon, I would imagine, right? There's no way we're going to avoid him forever. More crates, lovely jubbly. More tanks. Should be able to relax a little now. Don't forget about the yeah. Turks. Ah. Could come at us any time. Keep an eye out. That's what I was saying. Okay, so we've got a way to go that way, which takes us to the station. Uh, I don't think we'll be allowed to go this way. Nah. This place but we can certainly go this way. Just wanna go to bed. Don't blame you. So, do you think this means oh, hey there, huh, everyone seems to know Aerith, at least. Hello, young child. So nervous. Uh. Oh, wow. The center district of Sector 5, huh? What are they watching? Uh. Hey! Hey! hey. Oh, Whoa, where's my this snack? Way. I want a snack. Damn it, Eric, I want a snack. I'm standing inside the gutted shell of Mako Reactor 5. As you can see, there's still a lot of smoke rising from the rubble. While fallen beams and other debris continue to hinder rescue efforts, the fires appear to have been mostly extinguished. So we don't catch the bombers. That's the director of Shinra's Advanced Weaponry Division, isn't it? Excuse me, ma'am, but would you mind answering a few questions? Uh, but we're safe down uh, here, right? Uh, can you give us any updates reactors. on the status of the reactor? No reason what kind of damage did it suffer in the explosion? So Are we in any danger? <sighs> Mako Reactor 5 has been temporarily Actually, shut down, and all fires have been successfully like extinguished. That's wonderful. The Let's situation is under control, together. and the people of our fair city need not worry about any additional complications. We're in the process of conducting a full forensic investigation, but we suspect the device used was similar to that employed in the attack on Mako Reactor 1. I'll do anything to protect the perpetrators of that atrocity were filmed making their escape. These agents of the eco-terrorist group Avalanche are currently believed to be in hiding somewhere in Midgar. And uh, given that Actually, this group has now attacked two reactors in quick like succession, can they really be stopped before they strike again? Together. What do you think? Uh, well, uh... <laughs> 
fear. If a war does break Shinra out, will then keep kill Midgar enlist? safe. Of course. I'll do anything to protect the city I love. Okay, time's up. There we go. Right, <laughs> let's go. Scarlet, everyone. I'm to fight Ooh, you don't mess with Scarlet. This is loads of places that you can explore, but I doubt I'm going to be able to do that right now. I would imagine this will open up more side quests like the first place, so... Place is really hopping, huh? Nice side effect of the train situation. So, what do you say? I'd love to, but... I mean, we could help you later, but I kind of want that loot. Thank you. Can I just explore? Is that something I'll be able to do? Is she going to moan at me if I go down here? Yeah. Damn it, Aerith. <laughs> There'll be time for it later, I guess. Well, well. What are you doing all the way up there? I was trying to get a look at the reactor. Who's this guy? This is Cloud. He's a mercenary. And currently my bodyguard. That's Oats. See you. Hi, Oats. How's it going? Two peas in a pod. Okay. <laughs> Don't really like being a pea. I'd rather be a bean. What's this? Aaron! So, what are you guys up to? We all went to see the reactor. Oh, that's right. You're supposed to come by the house. Um, what for? I don't know. You're just supposed to. Well, guess we have a new destination. I should probably yeah. explain. The Leaf House is the local orphanage. That's where all these kids live. Hey, Eric, ah. where'd you go? The church again? Next time, we should all go together. Why, hello, Aerith. As popular as ever, I see. Apparently, but they sure keep me on my toes. <laughs> uh, better than being bedridden. Thanks again for all those herbs. You've helped a lot of people. No problem. Anytime. How'd you manage to find so many anyway? <laughs> oh, I have my ways. And him? He's my bodyguard. Just until I get home. And you're sure he's up to it? Hmm. Maybe. Okay. Since yeah, she I'm always so does generous, a lot of good, I though. I medicinal herbs for his patients sometimes. I'm studying so I can read a ton Here's the leaf books. house. The leaf house, huh? There you are. We're back, and we brought Aerith with us. Sorry to make you come out here. Don't be. It's on my way home. Well then, I hope you won't mind me asking for some flowers. No problem. How many? All you can carry. What with all the doom and gloom we've been hearing on the news recently, I thought some flowers might help cheer everyone up. I'm sure they will, and I'd love to help. Let's all wash up before our meal. Hi. Aerith is a real blessing. All of the children love to spend time with her. Oh, look at the Moogle. That's beautiful. <laughs> Oh man, the attention to detail. You can't beat it, can you? Square Enix have gone crazy with this. My god, I could be sat here for hours just watching these NPCs, listening to them, watching them do homework. It's so cool. All of the birds fluttering around. The flowers, the music. What's your favorite flower? They're all the same to me. Huh. You sure you want to say that to a florist? Better than lying. Okay. Then what'd you do with the flower I gave you? I, uh... You give it away? I did. Ooh, to who? Tell me. Don't recall. Hmm? What? Thought you didn't like lying. <laughs> well, anyway. Not even going to admit it's for Tifa? Oh, look, another arena. Look at all the flowers growing through this stuff. It's beautiful. Providing that nature is returning. Even slightly. 
wonder how much of that is due to Aerith being here. My house is just up this path. Mom should be home by now, so I'll introduce you. Oh man, I remember Aerith's house. Oh wow. Oh my goodness. You Would go. you look That's at this house. place? It's amazing. <laughs> Truly. Oh, there's the flowers. There's little fishies in the water. <gasps> oh, this is amazing. Oh. The waterfall. Hey, this is just... This I know, but I wanted to look at the fishies. This is so cool. Honestly, they've done a really good job here. Oh my god. Come on. Oh wow. I'm home. Hey, baby. Been up to no good? Rude came by. So, this is my mom, Elmira. And this is Cloud, my bodyguard. Uh, hi. Take good care of her? That's my job. Or was my job. Yep, thanks. So, Cloud, you gonna head back to Sector 7? Yeah. Then I'll show you the way. <sighs> then why'd you have me bring you here? What if the Turks show up again? It'd suck, but I've dealt with them before. Honestly? I'm much more worried about you. What if you get lost, huh? You'd be too embarrassed to admit it, and so you just keep on going. Quit acting like you know me. Hey, Mom. I'm gonna go take Cloud over to Sector 7, okay? <sighs> okay. But why not wait until tomorrow? If you head out now, it'll be dark when you get back. Better to rest up here and make the trip first thing in the morning. When you'll have daylight to spare. That's true. She's got a point, Cloud. Hold up. Oh, yeah. I still need to deliver some flowers to the leaf house. Since we have a little time before dinner, you should come with. That wasn't the deal. You mean you want more? Even though you've got a priceless reward coming your way, do you know what I promised him? I'll do it. <laughs> <laughs> I'll go grab the baskets. Be right back. <laughs> that Aerith. She's a handful, isn't she? You could say that. It must be tough. No, never mind. What? Hmm. Hmm. Is that all you're going to say? It must be tough. Mm, never mind. Look at the detail in here. Oh my goodness. The pumpkin, the onions here. The... What is that? The blurry... Blurry thing? The pink blurry thing. It was going so well. <laughs> oh dear. I've got to give him some credit though, where credit's due. It's beautiful, all the flowers and stuff. The detail in here. I mean, you're pushing the PlayStation 4 to its limits, aren't you? Absolutely wonderful. And there's also a picture of a kitty. Hello, kitty. Hello. Um, we've got TVs, look. <sighs> Can I go upstairs? Can I help you out? Oh, this is exactly as I remember it with the two bedrooms, look. Okay. All the way up, then. Do you need help, Aerith? With anything? It's the least I could do, right? Ooh, a balcony. Whoa, the light, though. There we go. Let our eyes adjust. Oh, we get to take this in slightly. So we've got this beautiful pile of wreckage here and the overgrowth, and then there's the fountain. Well, the fountain. The waterfall coming down into a sort of this pure place full of fishies. Everything is regrowing. All of the flowers. Look, we've got the white ones, the famous yellow ones. All of these veg. Look, this is fantastic. Absolutely fantastic. And a bright summer's day. Look, shining through the metal above. I'm in love with this. Really, truly. 
It's fantastic. Now we're going to let our eyes adjust again because it's dark. There we go. All right, let's go out the front and say hello to some fishies. No doubt we'll be interrupted by her anyway. Oh, no. You take this one. Take it. Right. Off we go. <laughs> and these right here are my babies. Yeah? The flowers? Or the fishies? Because the fishies are my babies, right? Like my in real life fishies that I keep. My goldfish. They're my babies. What are we doing here then? Gonna pick some flowers for our friends? That would be nice. Hmm. Which ones do you think we should pick? Any of them. Oh, don't be like that. I know you have an eye for this kind of thing. Picking flowers. Choose flowers to deliver to the leaf house. Press triangle when you're close to a garden to pick flowers. The decorations at leaf house change depending on the colors you select. Oh, wow. Can we get some uh, the red ones? Or... Well, the yellows are... Uh... Yeah, they're nice. Nice try, mister. You can't fool me. They are nice, though. I think we still need a few more. Which should we pick next? Um... Is there any more up here that we can choose from? Or is it just those? Yeah, it's just those. Okay. So we could have more yellow or more white. Oh, or these things. Are they catkins? Oh, foxtails, huh? Foxtails. I, to you, I never would have thought of that. It'll definitely take them by surprise. Yeah, I gotta add a bit of green, right? To offset the yellow. Beautiful. She said, as many as you can carry, so maybe a few more? Oh, okay. Well, there's not much choice Good then, eye. is there? People used to give these to declare their loyalty to one another. Interesting, right? That looks lovely. Look at that. That's a nice bunch. I think we're good now. What do you say? Shall we go? Yeah, absolutely. Let's do it. Let's make some kids' lives happier. Why not? Very wholesome. Very, 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 very wholesome today. Um, makes a change from smashing things in the face repeatedly. And we get to spend some more to quality me. time. We're not under the gun or anything. I'm not cut out for this crap. Sure you are. And when you're done, you'll be drowning in job offers. True. That's how this works, like, with the side quest stuff. We need to unlock the side quest so we can get more trophies. This is so cool, though. <laughs> I never thought we'd be doing... Well, I never thought I'd be walking with a basket full of flowers delivering to delivering so, them to children. I they'll arrange these flowers. Don't know. Well, we'll soon find out. Yeah, I never thought we'd be doing this in 2020, that's for sure. Definitely the highlight of my year. And I know it's only just begun, but the rest of the stuff in real life sucks, so there has to be something fun, right? And this is highly enjoyable. Even if we're just walking with flowers through rubble and wreckage. You just have to take it in, don't you? Absorb it all. Literally and figuratively. Oh, we can slightly increase our speed. I didn't even realize that. That's my bad. Hey, do you want a basket full of flowers? I picked them myself. I'll wait out here. Oh, okay. Wow, they're but beautiful. Be a while. Why not check out the town? <sighs> Sounds like a plan. Finally, we get to explore and do what we want to do. Well then, this might be a good opportunity to leave off for today. Um, mostly because I've been recording for just over two hours now for this episode. I've decided to increase the size of the episodes because, I don't know, people aren't watching them as much, but maybe you'd prefer it to be in a big bulk. If that goes the way I want it to, then you'll probably see more big, chunky episodes rather than lots of little hour-long ones. Um, especially considering how big this game seems to be. 
A lot of people are still complaining about padding. I think it's adding so much backstory that was sorely needed to the characters. So I'm loving this. I'm loving every time I upload this. Even if it gets like 200 views, that's better than nothing for me. And I know that the people who are loyal watching this, thank you so much from the bottom of my, bottom of my heart, rather. And I hope you'll continue to enjoy this playthrough. Um, we will be back to Final Fantasy XIV stuff periodically. But for the most part, I'll be playing this until there's something new. So thank you all kindly for watching and I'll see you in the next episode.